many of you may have noticed this over the past couple of weeks, neighborhood streetlights getting lit up in purple. Well, streetlights that don't seem to match up with the other lights. Eight on your sides, Marco Villarreal went looking for answers for us and is live in Seminole Heights with what he found. I have one on my street, Marco, what's it about? So many people have one on their streets. You'll notice them really easily when it gets dark. You'll have a purple light there right next to another street light that is the normal regular color. Now, all of these are LED lights. They are meant to be energy efficient and last longer. But guess what? You're not the only one noticing that some of these lights out here are purple. So is Tampa Electric. Some of those lights a few a few versions who, that were manufactured in 2019 are having some issues where they the light might appear purple. Now Tico says the issue is with one of the filters in the lights. They come with three, red, blue, and yellow, the primary colors. The yellow filters are going out, making the blue and red mix and create purple. When Tico first started hearing about this, they were asked if the purple lights meant something or was it a sign for something? Some thought it was some sort of discreet sign for law enforcement, the government, or aliens. No conspiracy theory behind the light. No conspiracy, exactly. No conspiracies. Although we can tell our kid, can we still tell our kid something that will help us along? Like that light turns purple if you haven't been eating all your vegetables, right? I support that, yes. <laughs> All right, so for those who want to get these light bulbs changed, and Tampa Electric is one of those, they're trying to change all the bulbs, they're asking that you report on their website where these lights are at. You do it the same as you would if you're reporting a light that has gone out on your street. So you go out, you fill out the form, but they say you gotta pay attention. There are 10 digit numbers on all of the light poles. They ask that you take notice of what those are Add it to the form as well as the nearest intersection, and within five days, Tico will come out and replace those purple lights with the correct light. So there's the information you need. We'll have this up on WFLA.com as well as the link that'll take you exactly to this form in just a little bit. Reporting live in Seminole Heights, back to you, Avery. Well, I'm just so glad, Marco, that you figured out that it's not aliens <laughs> that are coming in and changing no. our street lights. Whew. Really no. glad about that. Hey, this works on husbands too. Ooh, I'll text you later. Talk yeah, so if you want to say, if, if you want to say, hey, Joe, um, that light goes on when the pool hasn't been cleaned yet, uh, you know, you better get to it. I like it. There you go. It's our secret until he watches <laughs> later. <laughs> Thanks, Marco. Yeah.